Being homeless, every man for himself. Well, my family used to live here in Chicago, but they moved to Michigan. They play Michigan. You know, and then, you know, I'm waiting on my disability because I had messed my leg up. You know, and I'm 65 years old. So, I'm there there, you know, waiting for the disability to come through. But I'm too proud not to go to my family for help. Why? Why? Because, you know, I don't want to wanna, uh, burden them with, you know, my problem because, you know, I'm homeless. You know, so I lay there, you know, and just stay in these streets and my disability come through. Try to help you, son. So some think they might think they better than you because you homeless and they got a job. I've had to ill all night. All night. Yeah, back and forth. I get a, 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 a one day pass and I've had it back and forth. You see, they got a Pacific Garden. The reason why I'm going there, they got a lot of people there with diseases and all that type of stuff. And then they want you to shower and use the same soap and towels that they use over and over. And I won't catch no disease. Right. So that's why I don't go to the Pacific Garden. They feel like, I, you know, people like us don't want to work or nothing like that. But see, I'm disabled. You know, I have a rod and all that in my leg. I'm, and I, and I, I'm, I'm, I'm deaf in one ear. I have asthma. So, you know, therefore, I cannot work. I'm 65 years old. And I'm, you know, really basically retired. You know, so now what I'm doing is just waiting for my disability. Because if I was in a position, I would help you too. You know, but I'm not able to do that. So that's one thing I want to see them change, you know, is to help, help the people, you know, because one day you might be helpless, okay? Yeah.